Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Are they moving? Oh wait, no, that's my friend. Never mind. Okay, so today's video is actually going to be me skateboarding. So I don't know if I ever posted that video of me learning tricks. No, I didn't finish it. Never mind. So today I'm gonna actually do teaching you all the basics of skateboarding. I've been skateboarding for like a year now, like on and off, but I have really been doing it for the past two or three months, like a lot. I taught my friends how to do the basics and they taught me a lot too after I taught them how to like stand and move and stuff um, and we can learn together <laughs> yeah so that's what we're gonna be doing today hope you guys enjoy if you do make sure you like this video and hit the subscribe button please that would really help me um, in this channel also I have a new Instagram which I made today it's Addison underscore McClellan um, yeah and my TikTok is mostly Addy. Literally, it's called that. <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, let's get started. I'm going to show you guys me going down a driveway. That's a lot of fun. But there's also a humongous truck over here. So I'll be very bad if I ran into that. And of course, the truck lives right as I finish the video. Thank you. But they're not on my way. I can turn. No, I'm gonna set you guys up right here after this lady passes because she's walking a baby. Wait, that makes sense. Oh my god. Oh, by the way, disclaimer I am not the best at this. I'm not the best at skateboarding or anything. I'm not even that good. I just do this for fun, and this is just to help you guys get this, and I want to see your progress on this. Yeah, um, so we're gonna come over here and I'm gonna teach you guys how to stand. It's very easy after you get the hang of it. Oh my God, there's a lot of leaves. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to go on this side. Okay, so right here, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to stand. Um, you probably can't see the board. It's, you hear this is my board. I've had it for a couple years. It was my brother's, but he literally has not touched it in like five years. Um, first thing you need to know is you have to keep your balance and don't be scared to fall. It's like, not even a foot off the ground. That would be weird if it was. It's literally two inches off the ground. It's going to be okay if you fall. And I suggest you wear a helmet at the beginning. I don't have any helmets that fit me, so I just don't wear them. And also wear knee pads or elbow pads if you're able to. If you're going to go and do tricks, not whenever you just sit. So yeah, um... Oh, okay. Um, so here's my board. Okay, so here's the board. So you want to be holding on to something. But I'm left legged, I'm left handed, so I will have my left hand or my left leg on the board in front of these two nails. Or on the front or the back two nails. One, two, three, four. On these two, your foot is gonna be covering that. So right here, and then your other foot will be facing that way. So let's try. One foot here, and one foot facing this way. Yeah, oops, I'm going to oh, I'm gonna do that from my view so you guys can see that a little bit better. Okay, so like I said, behind the front two nails, so on the other two, facing forward, it's hard to do slowly. And then you can kind of like turn, pivot your foot a little bit, diagonal, and then this foot to facing out. And then after you get the hang of that, you can start to slowly move and then your foot up. You always push with your back leg because if you were to do it with your front leg, you probably fall. Yeah, I can't do that though. So yeah, that's how you do that. Make sure you keep your balance and if you do fall, make sure to fall to the side and probably not fall. You don't want to. Yeah. <laughs> it's really hard for me to explain this. And I suggest like holding on to something like a mailbox or um this i guess so i used to hold on to a mailbox or a trash can so you could just hold on and get on and then start to push and there you go okay so after you get that i did <laughs> that down i would personally suggest you to try to go uphill because my my like street is like this is uphill and that way is downhill you go really fast, you go well. not too fast, but pretty fast. So I suggest you go uphill. I'm not that good at uphill, uphill, but, you know, just 
lille praktisk. Praktisk. Det er sådan. Jeg ved ikke, hvordan jeg skal det. Just, you know? And then after you get that, if you can do that, and try to take as long, like, sh as less many strokes as you can, like, yeah, try to stay on for as long as you can until, like, you actually start to stop. Then push it in. You don't have to do it like this. Because, like, my life is going to help you learn and grow. But obviously, you are going to do that at the beginning. It is a little hard to start balancing. And also, to get off, you can run into a curb slow down like, like you know stopping with your foot that's personally what i do or jump off and now we're gonna work on turning also i'm sorry if i'm going really fast you can definitely stop and um, stop the video and rewatch whatever parts you need to okay so now for turning this is where it gets a little bit difficult it's a little scary um for some people in some ways so i'm left i'm left-handed so i have my left foot in the front and if I lean forward, I will turn right. And also don't lean too much forward to where like, the wheels are coming off the ground. And this is where it gets scary whenever you have to lean back. For most of y'all, leaning back, you'd be facing, you'll be turning that way, but you know it's opposite for me. So like, just try to stay on the board and try not to fall. <laughs> it's really hard to explain, I'm so sorry I suck at this. <clears throat> um, so yeah, you just lean. I suggest probably hold on to something whenever you're getting to the back end. Maybe get a little closer to that. Okay. So yeah. I holding on to this. And then I'm leaning back and turning and then leaning forward turning. So you know just like practice like moving back and forth. Okay, so I'm gonna try to turn for you guys. <gasps> okay, so I'm gonna try to turn. I was so bad because I didn't want to go out of frame. Ugh. Sorry, that was such a bad turn. I don't usually do it like that, but I did that time because... Oh, that's loud. Sorry. I did that time because I thought I was going out of frame, but I wasn't. Yeah. Okay, so here's like a little tip to not look like a complete beginner. And that's to do this. Oh, that, ow, shoot, that hurt. I've not done that since. I said shoot, don't worry. I said shoot, I'm not cussing on this channel. <laughs> but basically it's like to fling your board up and catch it. Whenever you're picking up your board. You have it like this, you walk around. And then whenever you go to get on it, step on the back lift. Ow, that hurt again. And, you know, on you know? Wait. Oops. <laughs> I'm trying to think of other things I could do for you guys. Maybe some tricks. I think that might be the next video. So yeah, um, next video we'll be learning some tricks. And my favorite trick, it's not really a trick, it's just something you do if you're at a skate park. And that's a drop in. Those are a lot of fun. And also, I'm not saying I'm the best at this again. I'm just throwing that out there. I'm not the best at skateboarding at all. But yeah. Um, if you do need more help and this video did not help, make sure you leave a comment on what I can do um, to help next time, some ideas, some tricks you'll want me to teach you. I'm actually working on an ollie right now, like teaching myself, because I don't have anybody to teach me. So yeah, that's why I'm trying to make these videos so I can help you guys. Anyway, so that's it for this video. I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on your post notifications to be notified every time I post. Bye!